Hi my beautiful lovelies and welcome back to my channel. So today as you can probably tell by the title of this video or just by the look, I'm going to be doing Deepika Padukone inspired makeup look. And this is the look she wore to Cannes Film Festival and I got pouring requests asking me to do this makeup look and I'm here to do it for you guys. And the reason why I'm obsessed with this look is because it is super powerful, super bold and empowering. I actually don't wear this kind of bold eye makeup. But as soon as I saw Deepika wearing this, I got totally and utterly obsessed. And I thought I have to do this look. So if you would like to see how I created this look, hair wise, makeup wise, jewelry wise, then please keep watching. And as always, I'm starting off with taking care of my skin. So I'm taking Kate Somerville Vitamin C Brightening Serum and I'm applying this all over my face. It's just because Deepika's skin is like gold. So I'm making sure I'm prepping my skin well. That's why I'm going with this particular serum, which instantly brightens up my face and provides immense glow. And then I'm quickly moisturizing my lips. For that, I applied Crystal Gloss from Incredible. This one is actually a lip gloss. You can either put underneath your lipstick or on top. Both ways, it works great and gives so much more hydration. And then for primer, I'm taking Maybelline Master Chrome Primer and I'm applying this all over my face. And I'm concentrating mainly on the porous areas of my face because Deepika's skin is like super poreless and baby bum smooth. So I have to make sure I'm filling in my pores nice and neat to make it look smooth and soft and poreless skin like Deepika's. And then for extra stickiness and as a extra prepping step, I'm taking my Urban Decay All Nighter Pollution Protection Spray and I'm spraying this all over my face. And this acts as an extra grip for the foundation and also gives glow to your skin as well. Now, before I put my foundation, I'm going to first color correct my hyperpigmentation. So I'm grabbing my NYX HD concealer in the shade medium, which has peachy kind of undertone to it. And I'm applying that around my eyes and also around my mouth where I have darkness and it instantly brightens up those areas. And I'm blending that seamlessly with a beauty sponge. And now it's time for the foundation. So for foundation, I took NYX Born to Glow Naturally Radiant Foundation mixed in with Smashbox Full Coverage Foundation. I'm mixing both together. I am dotting that all over my face first and then blended everything out seamlessly with a damp beauty blender. Deepika's base looks matte and also glowy. So I'm using these two together to get that full coverage glowy base like her. Now moving on to the eyes and also my favorite part of the tutorial. So to create her iconic wing look, I'm taking Stila Smudge Pot in the shade black. and I'm first mapping out the wing like you can see here. And I'm slowly and patiently creating a wing starting from the inner corner along the crease towards the outer. And I'm giving a little kick and stopping where my brow tail stops. And I used a flat eyeshadow brush to do this. And I did the exact same procedure on to the other eye as well before taking Urban Decay Perversion Eyeliner. And wherever I mapped out the wing, I just followed that wing by thickening it up with that pencil liner. And I'm checking both my wings in the small mirror, making sure they are looking as same as Deepika's. And then I went ahead and filled that empty part of my eye with the same Stila Smudge Pot liner.
now it's time to set the wing in place so i'm taking this black hole eyeshadow from one size patrick star visionary eyeshadow palette and this is in the shade turban legend and i'm packing that color right on top of the whole wing yes the whole wing because deepika's wing look super black intense and dark so i'm just mimicking it and this eyeshadow doesn't fall out or transfer so i'm using this color and then to fill any weird lash line gaps i'm taking a liquid eyeliner and this one is from nyx and this is a epic wear liquid black eyeliner and i'm filling in any lash line gaps and deepika's definitely wearing a pair of super dramatic falsies so i'm grabbing house of lashes dramatic falsies and i pop them on and to blend my natural lashes and falsies together i'm taking anastasia beverly hills lash brag active mascara and i blend it in both together To conceal and highlight the center of my face, I'm taking NYX HD concealer in the shade yellow and I'm applying that in the areas where I would generally like to add brightness and then blended everything seamlessly with a beauty sponge. And I'm making sure I blend under my eyes carefully so that I don't ruin the wing liner. Now I'm going to set the base makeup in place because other than her cheeks, the remaining skin looks matte so I have decided to set my base. For that I'm taking my Kat Von D Lock It Powder Foundation in the shade Medium Sand and dusted all over my face. And to achieve her goddess like sun kissed bronzer skin look, I'm taking Take Home the Bronze Bronzer in the shade Greg from The Balm Cosmetics and I ran that following the natural shape of my face and I'm going along the perimeters of my face quite thick because Deepika's face is super chiseled and sharp and I'm quickly going to contour my nose and lips as well. It's just to balance the shadows on my face and this creates the illusion of sharper and more chiseled face. Now Deepika is definitely wearing a super mute rosy blush so I'm taking a soft rosy blush from Milani blush palette and I'm applying that on to the apples of my cheeks and then I drenched my beauty sponge with some setting spray because if I sprayed that directly onto my face I may ruin the eye makeup and I don't want to risk that so I'm using this technique here and then patted that sponge all over my face especially onto the center of my face where I would be applying highlighter and speaking of the highlighter I'm grabbing my Mary Luminizer powder from the Balm Cosmetics and I dusted that illuminator onto the tops of my face especially onto my cheeks and it's a super light reflecting highlighter and gives a very nice natural looking glow to your skin without settling in glittery or shimmery or anything like that. And I'm popping the same highlighter onto my brow bone area as well as a soft looking gorgeous highlight like the Picasso. And to finish off my eyes, I took the same Greg bronzer from The Balm and I ran that along my lower lash line part because that's what it looks like she did with her lower lash lines and then applied some mascara onto my bottom lashes as well. And then I quickly filled in my brows. I used my current obsession which is Urban Decay Brow Beater Pencil in the shade Dark Drapes and I filled in my brows and brushed through them to remove any excess product. And for the lips, I took the lip balm off with a washcloth because I want these lips to look super matte. And then I took Anastasia Beverly Hills Liquid Lipstick in the shade 
Sepia because she seems to wear a gorgeous matte mauveish cool toned brown lip. So I chose this one and I think it perfectly matched her lip color. And then I did a top knot messy bun and wore similar looking headband and earrings and sari as well. And that you guys is the makeup look complete. Thank you so so much everyone for watching. I hope you guys really enjoyed this Deepika Padukone inspired makeup look. Please make sure you subscribe and turn on the notification bell to be notified every time I post a new video and the button is just right here on the screen. And also like this video if you do and I'll see you guys very 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 soon in my next one. Bye.